Have you ever wondered what really makes AI tick? So underneath all the hype of ChatGPT and Google Gemini, there's one simple architecture driving it all, which is the neural network. And here's the simplest way to picture it. Think about results day. A student might be choosing between university, an apprenticeship or work. And they don't just flip a coin, do they? They weigh factors. So maybe the university's reputation, the course itself, the location, um, employability prospects, and even commuting time. So each of these factors matter differently to different people. For one person, reputation might be the biggest weight. For another, it's employability. Now, what we do is multiply each factor by how important it is, add them up, and whichever option scores highest, that would be the rational decision. And that is exactly what an artificial neuron does. Each input, whether it's a pixel in an image or a word in a sentence, gets multiplied by a weight. And the neuron adds it up, passes it through a filter and fires forward. So on its own, one neuron isn't powerful. But when you connect millions, even billions in layers, something remarkable happens. Patterns emerge. And suddenly machines can recognize faces, translate languages, or even generate poetry. And from an economic lens, this is where things get interesting. Scaling up neural networks costs millions. So you'd need rare chips, server farms, and mountains of electricity. So while anyone can use these tools, only a handful of corporations can build them. And that's why neural networks democratize access for users, but concentrate power for builders. And here's the reflection. In life, growth also happens in layers. We start with words, then grammar, then stories, then wisdom. But unlike machines, our learning is lived and grounded in meaning. Whereas machines scale by math, we scale by values. And that's why neural networks matter, not just for what they can do, but for what they remind us about ourselves. You wanna know the full story? Watch the complete episode four now on the AI Compass season one on digging deeper insights. See you there.